So this, you've probably heard of this already, but this is what I think put psychological safety on the map in recent years. I had been studying this construct for quite a long time when a widely publicized study at Google called Project Aristotle that set out to answer the simple question, which is, um, why do some teams sort of outperform others? What is it? You know, is it their education? Is it the gender mix? What is it? All this research, all this data analytic capacity that Google has, um, three-year study, 180 teams, and what did they find? Well, as Julia Rosowski, who led that study, PhD psychologist, um, said, psychological safety emerged to their surprise as the crucial factor the factor differentiating higher performing and lower performing teams. That got their attention, right? That got them interested in, well, what can we do? What can we do to increase the psychological safety um, of our teams? Now, one thing you have to make sure to take away from this study is not that Google had particularly high or low psychological safety, but rather that Google had particularly high variance in psychological safety. Otherwise, it could not have emerged as a predictor. So what we learn is this is not a function of organizational culture. The organizational culture at Google is fairly strong um, and, and, and recognizable. But what we learn is that this thing called psychological safety, which describes the interpersonal climate, varies. It varies across teams in the same organization. All right, so this is something we want to keep in mind going forward. It's kind of the good news and the bad news, right? The bad news is it could be very hard to say, okay, let's have a psychologically safe organization, the whole thing. We're going to get it right. Um, that's going to be difficult to do. But the good news is wherever you work, wherever you stand, you have the opportunity to create psychological safety in your team. It's a pocket. It's a bubble that can be created, and we'll talk about how, um, and without worrying so much about the whole organization. 